Hello. <laughs> um, I am here this first camping, and I thought today is a beautiful day. I should give you uh, a little glimpse of my home and uh, how I built it, which is a no-built built. Um, so let me show you that and um, some little tricks that make my life a lot easier when I am out here. I am in this very beautiful forest of the National Forest Service and uh, they have my hammock and my van um, with a few things that I will show you. And this one in particular, they left a lot of wood here and uh, before I leave I will clean these branches so the whole place is a little nicer for the next person. But let me show you my little uh, home here in the middle of the forest. Um, absolutely beautiful place. So he, down here I have my solar panels and you know they feed the battery and I connect the fridge and my phone and everything to that battery. Then I have this table uh, with, I just finished my coffee and uh, and then of course I will sit down there and read a book or something. I don't know. So I do have this little curtain that helps a little bit to hide and to provide uh, shade, which is always good. And this is the side that is more practical for me to get in the van from. So I have a little rug there. And here you have a first idea of what we have. So, first of all, I have this plastic chest that is my nightstand, a little bit of a pantry. Um, I don't know, lots of different little things are there. And the last drawer that I left a little open is just a few pants and jeans. Uh, the bed itself is just shelves, which legs I uh, cut at different lengths, so they are the same height. And a few um, plastic totes with things I want to have with me, my books, some clothes, my little stove to prepare coffee or food or something. And then the bed itself, I will show you on the other side. I decided to have a bed. Many people do have uh, just sleeping bags on those uh, shelves or whatever unit they put in there. But I really like getting in a bed. So for me, the option was clear and this was my best option. Then around here I have my toilet. Yep, my toilet is hiding in here. That is a, an ottoman that I got. I emptied it and I use it to cover my toilet just because I don't want to see the toilet. I have a little fan here that uh, provides nice breeze if it is a little hot. And um, let's see how what it looks like if we remove the curtain. So that is my fridge. It's a 36 liter Alpico, very convenient. Um, it is a dual chamber, so you can have some things at a lower temperature. Uh, this little cabinet, I have all my electronics here and different things 
that I don't access every day. So that is the view of my little home on wheels. Um, as you see, there is a curtain that is on a rail, just a sh uh, I suppose it is a shower rail or a curtain rail that I just stuck in the little nook there without having to put any screws or anything. I didn't want to alter the vehicle itself. These little things I will show you on the other side are like the best ever. Sometimes the small things make a huge difference. Um, these are, as, as you can see, they are gut, uh, gutter guards to, to protect the gutters from the leaves. If you cut them to the size of the window, they do have a little mesh and that is enough to stop mosquitoes and it allows for a nice breeze going in and out. Um, you see another side of the shelves and these are the sun blockers that I use on the windows just like those ones there. Those I never remove because I don't need those windows to see out when I am driving. But these ones cover the back gate and the other two side windows and they provide a lot of shade. So this is another side, the other side of the of the bed. And then of course in the in the front window on the windshield I have those sunlight uh, blockers. They are amazing to keep the van not too hot. And then for the little things I told you, well, I love my chair, super comfy. Uh, for the little things I told you that make a difference sometimes, uh, this is, for example, something that keeps the, the van, the interior, dry. It is electric, so when it is wet, when the granules inside are green because they are wet, you just plug it in, it warms up, it evaporates the humidity, and they become yellow again, and they are there just absorbing humidity like this. You don't need to plug it to make it work. This is another thing I never thought was going to be so good. This is a bag that rafters use to put their belongings in there to that float in case they lose them. That bag floats. In my case, I got it for trash. So when my trash bin here is full, I take that bag and I put it in the in this little bag because it doesn't matter whether I may have I don't know banana peels, orange peels, all those things that are smelly. When I put them in there, they don't smell in the car. So at night, I don't have to cope with the smell of those things. And that is just thanks to that little thing. Then we have my gym bag, which I use to go to the gym to, to shower, of course. And, um, and I have a, a little bowl there with my bear spray and organic soups, organic soap, all those good things. Beluga goes with me, very nice co-pilot. I have some small documents and vitamins and things there. And uh, believe it or not, this is 
more than enough to keep me really, really, really comfortable. Oh, one other thing that is also a great addition is this laundry bag. I also put all the clothes that have to be washed in there and uh, I don't need to have them around while I mean while waiting for the wash to happen and here I have well the table yes of course I have a four gallon uh, water tank that is more than enough for me for three or four days sometimes more uh, sometimes I get some if drinking water just if this one is too old I get some of these just so I have fresh water and then I have in the fridge in there I have uh, in the fridge I have two bottles of water that are cold and when I am uh, when I want to drink I just put the water in this bottle the lark it does have after putting the water there I turn it on I don't know if you will see it there but a little blue light starts showing because it is treating the water with blue light and ultraviolet and uh, it kills bacteria so I drink cold water from here I know it is super clean and the water stays cold for hours and hours great addition to my my little collection of useful things so this is this is it this is my minivan it allows me to get into these beautiful places and look who's coming to visit yep she's very interested in what we were saying that is the beauty of this purse camping thank you